Hi everybody, this is Lithi Readings and hi Leo. Let's see what messages will show up for you guys. Leo, in case this reading resonates, there will be a, a reading about your person linked in the description box, so do have a look if you want. Okay. Show me what's there for Leo. Show me what's... Ooh, Queen of Cups. Queen of Cups wanted to show its face. In love, in love. <laughs> I feel like a lot of you have um, certainly shown somebody your vulnerable side. Um, yikes, looks like you rushed into something or you want to rush into something. I don't know. Show me what's there for Leo. I shuffle. Show me what's there for Leo. Oh, Leo. You are so in love with this person. That devil energy was showing up as well for you before. Your overall energy is the Queen of Pentacles, working on yourself. It's like you're silently working on something. Um, see? So you do have your priorities in check, Leo, but when it comes to love, I feel like a lot of you are having a hard time deciding between something, if I'm going to be honest with you. And for a lot of you, I'm also seeing options in love. Leo. <laughs> okay. Uh, whoever is coming towards you is, you know, they're in this energy of stress or, you know, with the nine of swords. Uh, maybe it's about how do I say what I really want to say? You know, when somebody wants to express something and they go about it being like, I really want to say this, but I don't know how to say this. That is what their energy is like, whoever this person is. Um, it's like somebody's having a hard time manifesting something with you, okay? You, on the other hand, it's like a balance that you want to attain between love and something else, mainly because I feel like you are falling for somebody or you fell for somebody and you knew that, you know, you got obsessed with this situation and there is like in the back of your head, you know that I, I need to back off, I need to back down and, you know, I need to maintain a certain level of independence in this situation. Uh, <laughs> Show me the Knight of Cups, the Ace of Wands. There is uh, lots of passion here that somebody could be possibly feeling towards you. Um, most certainly, whoever is approaching you is feeling very inclined towards you, okay? Um, whoever this person is. What's the Nine of Swords? Ooh, clarifications, uh, confessions, what not, judgment, a decision to be made. Leo, it already looks like it's going to be like full of communication, confession, clarity, what not, okay? Um, there is a heavy, heavy, heavy focus on communication. Um, and there also could be more than one person coming your way. Just saying, okay, I'm seeing, uh, oh my God. Okay. There's a lot of like socializing going on or like something online. What is it? Like you're talking to people, people are coming in towards you because there's an energy of people coming into your life or external energy. Okay. That is also very much connected to, um, communication so some of you maybe your job is like that or I don't know what it is but it's it's like you're getting a lot of attention and you are also falling for somebody you're in love with somebody I can clearly see that eight of wands communication honestly there isn't anything to dig here in this reading if I'm gonna be really honest with you and this is a really good reading because it's like there's a sense of confession or clarity coming through for you 
Okay, so let's see. What's the devil? I heard wanting to have their cake and eat it too. Whoever this is. Uh, you think about somebody too much, Leo, and you deep down know it, but you're trying to maybe run away from it by being like, okay, I need to maintain this sense of self. I need to maintain this sense of balance because I cannot be head over heels for somebody. It could be a fairly new connection or it could be just like somebody you like through mutual friends, but there is an energy of love with the two of cups. The person that you're connecting with also likes you, but they're hesitating to open up, although there is a confession from them. Um, and I like it. <laughs> I like it. I like this energy because it's like, you know, there's a lot of newness in the energy for you. And like I said before as well, Leo, there is a lot of focus on communication. What's the Queen of Pentacles for Leo's overall energy? What's the Queen of Pentacles for Leo's overall energy? What's the Queen of Pentacles for Leo's... Oh, High Priestess, trusting your intuition. Very wise energy. Like you're not wanting to rush into something because previously maybe you rushed into something because that was the energy that I saw when I was shuffling. You probably rushed into something that you have regrets that you rushed into it. Now, you're really thinking uh, how much you're going to give into a situation. Because apparently, you don't want to give too much into it. Um, you're not wanting to give too much into it. You're, you're being controlled in your uh, actions, okay? Tell me the Eight of Swords. Hoping for things to change, even thinking about change. Um, but there is a certain level of resistance here because eight of swords to the wheel of fortune, nine of pentacles. Patience, perseverance. You're trying really hard to control something, Leo. Like, I can see it. I don't know what exactly it is. But yeah, there is something you're really trying hard to control. Um, What's the Nine of Pentacles? Yeah, I'm happy. I'm happy by myself. I, I can do this by myself. I pretty much don't need you. Or I have a strong sense of self. I feel like some of you weren't expecting that you were going to get into a situation the way you did. And, you know, even though you know what you feel towards the person or the situation, you are trying to maintain that sense of self, that balance, which is good growth expansion i'm not saying you're coming from an insecure place you're just not but that resistant energy is coming from the devil and the eight of swords where is it you know where is the link here the king of cups love emotions feelings um whatnot some somebody's also afraid of tragedy like you may feel like it's not going to work out or something like that tell me about the magician uh, Page of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles, and the Temperance. Somebody's trying to work things out. This could also be a person at your work, um, uh, Leo. There is for sure somebody who's trying to work things out, who's trying to make things right with you. And um, I don't know, get things going. <laughs> the Temperance. Healing, patience, balance. Okay, one thing I get here is that whoever is coming towards you has been thinking long and hard to do this. Uh, you know, it's like mustering up the courage to say what they want to say. Hierophant, uh, oh. Leo, your energy is more so like you may see a relationship with somebody, but a lot of you feel like it's too early to, uh, I don't know think about that because look at that i constantly see a level of detachment or a level of distance that you're trying to maintain from somebody um that was for love like let's see what's up generally for you show me leo what's going to be the challenge for leo for the next few days
ignorance avoiding something oh my god Imp being impatient ignorance avoiding something that's your challenge feeling confused over and over again what's the advice for leo the lovers and the eight of cups so leo you have to make a choice between something and the choice merely include includes having to walk away making a choice to walk away or staying stuck somewhere that can be applied to anything your job your i don't know like your home your love whatever there's a choice to be made here and that choice is merely connected to either investing or staying stuck or walking away let's see um show me what's there for leo Free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. Very evident and clear. Something you need to let go of. There's a certain level of confinement here. Okay. So let's see. What more? Healing family shoes. Something that you need to heal from. Something you need to let go of. Uh, and not let it be a barrier anymore. Um, I feel like some of you also have a problem with overgiving in situations, okay? They're sneaky. They don't... Mm. Yikes. Overthinking about the situation. What have I been saying all throughout the reading? Your person is overthinking, so are you, but there's more on their side. Now, Leo, this person's sneaky. Why? Because they don't want to see you with someone else, but they're also not expressing their feelings right now. And it's like with the mirror energy, you both are somewhat mirroring one another. But I'm, I'm not going to lie, Leo, that mirror energy also represents things that we need to look within ourselves and reflect upon. Bottom of the deck, I want you. So the bottom line is that this person wants you, but mm, looks like there is a confession coming through, but we will see. What's the guided message for Leo? What's the guided message for Leo? Guilt, I release any beliefs that no longer assist in my soul's growth. A feeling that needs to be released, understanding yourself, moving on, moving forward, letting yourself grow and expand, uh, facing the adversity, challenges. Doubt, I release the need to know all the answers. So the key phrase here seems to be I release things that you need to let go of things that you need to release ironically free yourself again having to release yourself from something um there's a lot of self-doubt guilt shame i don't know what is it like you know a blockage within you and your feelings or it could be external i don't know something needs to be worked upon and released so that's it leo um those were the messages and like look at this this is a similar message that i told you here that something needs to be released something that you need to emotionally withdraw from okay so that's it leo those were the messages that showed up for you um give this video a like and subscribe to my channel and check out the reading about your person it will be linked in the description box if you're interested take care and bye, -bye.